Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, The Lost Chevalier, and you're welcome back to Hand of Fate. Let us go, shall we? Story mode. This one is the Jack of Scales. Good. Mana drain. Cooldown times for weapon and artifact are double. Last man standing. In every combat, the last enemy can no longer be stunned or interrupted. Got it. The suit of scales are represented by these lizard men. Quiet, patient, lethally subtle and coldly intelligent. Of all the creatures I have incarnated as suits, these please me the most. I see, old man. Okay, I'm ready. Let's start. We have taken Do your magic. Symbols, but now we begin to play in earnest. My scepter is at stake, and I do not intend to lose it. Scales. <laughs> I have saved the lizard men for now, but the stakes have been raised. There is no weapon I will not use against you. Don't worry, I'm gonna I'm gonna win anyway. What is this? Marketplace. New Not a good day to be in Stiegel. So few are. You arrive at the town of Stiegel on market day. The market vendors are buying food today. You may offer some food, but the amount of gold you will receive it is not guaranteed. Um no, I will keep all my food, thank you. You choose to keep all your food and leave the market. Oh, damn it. It's okay, I need the food yet. The loan again. Give him ten gold, because it will come out it will come out later. Useful. The stairs. Descend ever no. deeper. Turn into back. Subterranean pit. Help from Freest. You made a wandering. Give the half your food. It will give me a lot of. It will give me a lot of. Of how do you say this? A lot Choice. of. Select your desire. God damn it! I think it was this one. Yes. Two blessings. Good. Self righteousness on any heat. Powerful. The player inflicts. Rebalance that next time. The player inflicts two more damage for each blessing they possess. Brought of the gods, Very at the beginning nice of every battle, indeed. the old gods throw down thunder upon one of your enemies. Good. I have lost Down half my food, but it's okay. Seeking the heart of it all. Take the stairs. I appreciate your efforts. I worked hard on this game. It is a pleasure to see you play. A ship at dock is worth nothing until it sails. Let's buy. What is in here? Asleep in the forest. Spirits roaming the darkness. With the struggles, the boundaries are weaker than they've ever been. While sleeping in the forest, you are jolted awake by a voice calling your name. You see a badly human-shaped ghost rushing towards you. You are quick to your feet, weapon already in hand. The ghost stops abruptly, hand signaling that it means no harm. Its voice is weak and distanced. You forget me already? Has this place already corrupted you so? Lower your weapon. I should not be here. I fear his servants already know where I am. For a brief moment, the goat pale eyes feel achingly familiar. Please come home soon. You blink and the goat is gone. At your feet is, at your feet is a bag of food. The card token is now yours. Three food. Good. I'm sure you are grateful for that. I am. Okay, interesting. Let us continue travels. I have nothing for the merchant. Let's buy it. Go there. Go there. Cave out. So this is the end. Uh, I will turn back. I want to see what is down here. Oh, here is the, the thing. Gold. More gold. And even more gold. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I can do this. The Mohan Barrel. Win this and claim my token. When you return to the Mach and Barrel, you spot the Huntsman lurking in a shadowy corner of the bar. A solitary warm ale sits cooling in front of an empty chair, while a collection of empty mugs indicates that your arrival has been long awaited. 
I started without you, he says, cheerily, but without looking up. I have, got, I have got questions for you, and you will have questions for me. Questions lead to stories, stories lead to memories, and I cannot bear this without a lot of these. He rakes his mug across the others on the table, producing a discordant chime. Sit down, you are making me look impolite. Given that you have already tracked me through the forest and Galen, I see that trying to disguise myself, dis dissuade you from this hunt will be pointless. I know you, how, how you feel. How you feel? I was a boy of five when I first saw it all white, whitey. Sorry, that's what we, I call him, the white minotaur. The huntsman proceeds to tell you a tale of destruction it and has grief. It's called the game of eternity that we play. I didn't think that meant you'd take forever to make a decision, mind. I'm reading. A tale deca decades, in the ma decades in the making. After a while, he lapses into silence like a river that, that has run dry. I think I was tracking it when you stumbled into my trap. Head back into the forest and see what you can find. I have, I have got business to attend el to elsewhere. Take it. The card token is now yours. Thank you. Let's go here. Dreadman's Gorge. Run so short. You are on risky ground. While crossing the ancient rope bridges of Dread, Dread, Deadman's Gorge, you hear sounds of movement from below. It is an ambush. Two skulls. Ah, I can deal with them. I can deal with them in the seconds. It's not even going to last a minute against me. Hello. Right, last man standing. But you're gonna die anyway. Bye bye. Easy. Now give me my reward. You recover what you can from the dead. Three foot. Ten foot. So I don't need to go and buy food. That's what you're telling me. Traveling jeweler. Let's see what he was he's sold in. Approach the job. The shop. Okay, what do you sell you? Um, blessing ring. Shield bash. After every three combat, the player receives 20 health. All weapon attacks are enhanced with a powerful poison that taints the victim's mind and body. That's a little expensive. This one is also a little expensive. Oh, damn it. That wasn't the click I needed to buy. I need to click it back. Now let's buy some food. Let's just buy you some, some good food. Uh, give me three more. Perfect. Now that I, can buy, I buy all of these from you, I will leave. Thank you for your service, traveling merchant. I don't need you anymore. Let's go here, and from there we go here. And exit the cave. You embark upon the next area. What brings you to play the game? Ha, I know you will not tell me. Like all the rest. Angry Guildmaster. Silent. A challenge for you, and a token if you succeed. As you travel the dark streets of Stigal one night, an old man atop a mighty steed nearly knocks knocks you down. Humbly apologize. Out of I went, peasant, he calls as he rides away. My daughter has run away with a vagabond. Okay, I need to attempt to steal from him. Traveling healer. I have nothing to do with a healer. Pass by. Let's go here. Calling the rat man. We play for a token. Now. How much gold? Fifty gold. I don't have that much, so refuse. Yeah, I know the traveling merch, the traveling healer, but I don't need anything from a traveling healer. Not now. Let's go down here. Stairs. Head downwards. If you I take dare. the stairs. No, I didn't want to. Damn Did it! You to expect me to tell your fortune. No. A fortune teller is at their most base and despicable when they begin to believe their own lies. Alicia Underworld. I am different. As you attempt My to discover more about the bizarre portal you encounter, one name keeps recurring, a mystic a mystic named Alicia. Apparently her expertise on all on all aspects of shadow realms, inter interdimensional travel and beast of the void is unparalleled. 
Jutraka leads a caravan, she travels under the guise of a fortune teller. Her appearance doesn't match the whispers about her. She is considerably shorter and has much more of a beard. She audibly clears her throat before speaking to you. Welcome, stranger. She recoils in mock blindness. The dark clouds of fate swirl around you in a tempest. For a little goal, I can help you see your future through the storm. Explain your interest in finding out more about the underworld. The mystic looks around nervously before saying, Now, what makes you think that I do know anything about such things? I am but a humble fortune teller. Can I not interest you in such services? Pay three gold. Oh, that is a crystal success or failure, no matter what I do. I think it's this one. No? Ah, damn it. The mystic excels and opens her eyes. You detect a hint of disappointment. You will travel to many exotic places in your lifetime. Pay three more gold. I will take this one. This one. God damn it! Hard work pay off in the future. Lazy in space. No. Ah, oh, come on. I give me another one. This one is the last one, though. This one. <laughs> I don't. God damn it. Uh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm, I will pay another one. Just the last one. The last one. The last one. The last one. This one. I'm going off. Refuse. Sign out of the freaks and half truths. Bye bye. The lovers. But I have already. Or a romantic. Um. The man paid them for my assistant. After sharing a look with his betrothal, the young man thinks long and hard before reacting to the decision. We have nothing of value to offer but a wedding ring. If they must be sacrificed for our love, then so be it. Whenever the player receives healing, they also gain one gold. No benefit if you were already fully healed. I will take it. Another equipment heart? Survival ring. 20, 20 health. After a lot of things. Good. Okay, let's go for the success. Hey, this one. Why is this happening to me? You make it to the outskirts of town. You make it to the outskirts of town before a voice in the darkness call out. Who goes there? It's my father's men, the young lady exclaims, fleeing. Her lover follows her, leaving you to deal with the guards. Um, tree of dust, uh, I can take care of them. They are nothing. I can totally take care of them. Hello, how are you doing? Die. A kick in the freaking stomach and that's all you need. After the battle, there is no sign of the young lovers. You quickly leave the scene as more armed men approach from all directions. Call up for the priest. In a shady grove about a trade, you find a traveling merchant looking for a trade with wandering adventures. I don't have enough gold, I will pass by it. Ratman hunting, they might have some food. Leader is a fine way to provoke them. For a plague, I can deal with them. I can totally deal with them. I love the blessing of the old gods. So powerful. Ow. Die. Done. Done so. Ah, they have nothing on them. Ladder scrape. So this is the rest, the other area. Let us climb the ladder. Actually, I don't want to. I don't have enough food to do. The are nothing if not patient. He waits for you. The maiden. I need food for supplies. 
One foot. A little food. Three foot. Not a great change, but enough to switch the odds a little. Rodman hunting. No. Okay, give bring them back. Bring them to me. I will take I will make I will take care of them. Oh, they don't have the the support. Ow, ow. Dead. <laughs> a shop. It's the regular old shop. Just go in. I don't think I have gold to buy anything except for food, so we are going to buy that. Let me see what they have. Yeah, everything is super expensive. I don't have the money for that, but I have. I can buy food. Maybe. I'm sure you are grateful for that. Done. Let's leave. Uh, let us go down here. Goblin's King holds three. Again, oh. a token is at stake. Hoy, lad! The enigmatic goblin, Mr. Lionel, climb out of a barrel behind a tavern as you pass through up a small village. I have made some refinements for the magic device, and I think we'll do better this time if we make another shot of, at those treasure vaults. You see, goblins sometimes hide their best treasure, magic items, and such like, in enchantment treasure chest. The magic amulet will now reveal this to you, if there should be chance to be one in any treasure vault we, we happen to visit. What did you say, lad? Shall we have another shot at the goblin's king treasure? Yes, good lad. Let's go right now. I think I have located one in a desert not far from here. Under the blazing sun of nameless desert, you and the goblin find a door, partially buried beneath the shifting sands. You can keep whatever gold you recover, but remember to look around for treasure chests. They are sure to hold something worthwhile. So nothing complicated this time, like gather f 550 gold. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Uh, oh, there is gold in here. Okay, I can take it. Ah! God damn it! The traps deal a lot of damage. Oh damn it! Oh damn it! Ah damn it! Isn't there another? No. Okay, I have. Uh, I, I. This wasn't the best run. I lost almost half my health. Good work, Mr. Lionel! exclaimed, seeing the loot you have returned with. You see, I told you there was some. There were more to gain for this pout. You divide the treasure between the two of you. Lot three cane cards. Equipment. Frost Fang, let us equip it, really? yes. Is that what you're going to do? Another equipment. During combat, press 2 to create a blast of freezing ice. And 50 gold. Yeah, this was stupid. I will go up and buy me and buy me some heal. I think he was selling healing too. Let me see. Yes, heal wounds. Please. I need it. No, 50. Yeah, 50 is okay. But it is only a momentary respite. Leave, yes. Yeah, I'm healed now. But I'll I gather some frosty thing. Dead King's Hall. Ah damn it. Two monster cards. Skulls and scales. Time to take them by surprise. So, huge success or nothing, huh? Choose this one. Okay, this one, this time I got it, right? You leap into one of them. I want to take care of the one with skulls. 
I will take care of the scales. I have the frost sword, so that deals extra damage to lizard men. Whoa! Got him. Got him. Oh, 50 health. I only need 8. And 40 gold. And 3 gold. Next area. The treasure chest. Approach the treasure chest. Success. There are two chances that I have to succeed. This one is success. Yep. I follow that car. You approach the chest. Now we have the chest. Time to pry it open. Okay, we have three in, a, in, a, three in four chances of success. I cannot fail. Yep. And we gain four gain cards. Four gold. Fourteen gold. Thirteen gold. And fifteen gold. Yeah, I'd rather come back to the shop and buy something. An armor, maybe. Approach the shop. Some food and armor will be will be good. Buy items. Do you have an armor? This unique item upgrades the class of your armor from light to medium or from medium to heavy. Take it. There's Buy no it. strength like hidden strength. And the other things I don't necessarily need them. I just want to buy some food. Let us buy 10 food and we go and we will go I'm in a sure merry way. For that. Perfect. Um let us go down. Ember toned hero. Um ask him if he travels. Uh ah, let us fight him off. I don't know what happens. This is all I believe. Oh, Jesus. Luckily, I, I followed the right card, but still. You managed to accidentally impale him. You took... You'd loot his body. Three food. Emberton heroes, sorry for what happened. Traveling mage. Maybe he has something interesting. I have enough gold, and I have enough food to survive. I just need to fight the lizard man. What items do you sell? Democles, that, this, I will take the hack scrap. Slowing and waking your opponent. I will take it. Buy it. It's not enough that you kill them, you'll curse them too. Yep. Um press two to attack faster with each successful strike. The longer you combo, the more explosive the reaction. Sounds good. I will take it. Bye. A wonderful creation. Yes. Forged of alchemical processes. But given permanent shape, I know of nothing like it. Live it, live it, live it, live it, live it, live it, live it. So one of these two is the lesser man. Here it is. Now a fight for the ages. I expect greatness. The lizard man potentially allows him to nullify the magical abilities of the player weapon and artifacts. Their latent magical abilities make this lizard man feared by all, even their own king. You Even the Lord Kai. Secrets of your memories, you'll gain new cards. Nullify the magic abilities of the flyer, touched. so I just buy something for nothing if I cannot use it. And four of scales, I can deal with him. I can totally deal with him. Let me see him. Yeah, I can deal with you. So I cannot use number two. That's what you're saying. Let me see. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> that was so easy. That was so freaking easy. Give me the card, give me the scepter. Hmm. Well played. Well played indeed. You have defeated something that I never expected to die. New starting gear, Bradman strength, bandit skill, release summon increase. So everybody's stronger than before, but I'm stronger too. represents my will in the purest sense. It is not too late for you to give up now. Go peacefully to your fate and leave me to mine. You begin to assemble a credible deck. Let us see what happens next. Give it to me. You show the ghost you are merciful, you receive a sleep in the inn. For the million the husband you receive tracks in towns. For helping Mr. Lion in his quest, you receive the Golden Treasure number four. For defeating the lizard man, you receive Queens of Coal, Metal Ore, Holy Forge, and Dark Ritual. For defeating the lizard man, I receive two equipment cards. Got it. Halfway done. Thank you. Let us continue. Into the depths we go. Searching for the dead and dying. Yes, but this is going to be for another episode for tomorrow to be more exact, more precise. Thank you very much everybody for watching. I hope you had a blast. I was the Lost Chevalier, signing out. Bye bye.